will be so we will register this event uh, this will help us uh, so we will uh, resend uh, the presentation made today to each of you so you can um, check uh, the, this presentation because it's recorded uh, maybe if you want to go back uh, to understand a bit more in details how everything is working so thank you very much again to everyone to join i can see that more and more people are joining us at the moment so welcome to everyone welcome to the world uh, today is the 6th october 2021 and uh, the good part is that um, the COVID is going away hopefully soon soon and uh, what we offer today here is a completely new concept, and, and this is in cooperation with uh, Xenophon College London, uh, which offer the degree from Chichester University. And for this reason, I would like to welcome here Sara, which is the head of the teacher. Hello, Sara. How are you today? Hi, Hi Rachel. Thank you for having us. All fine. Hi, Bajinder from sunny London <laughs> as well. Uh all yes. good. Thank you. Thank you, Sara. Good. I can see, Sara, that is already Christmas on your yes. uh, new world. Yes. This is fantastic. Yes. This is very absolutely, wonderful. absolutely. We we need we need to keep up the good spirits and start being kind towards each other in these difficult times. Never forget that. Fantastic, fantastic. So in the meantime, I'm speaking to all of you. I can see that more people are joining us. This is why I always take these two, three minutes uh, before to start with the presentation. So we just welcome uh, shortly my colleague Bajinder uh, from, um, from the UK. And we welcome one of my oldest clients, uh, Otto from Hungary. And uh, now I can see that the late people are joined, final to join us today. Thank you, Sara. Sara. I think we are ready to start, and uh, I think uh, the first part, maybe if you can give a short introduction about uh, Xenophon College London, and uh, you can explain a little bit uh, how Xenophon College London is working, and uh, how they have the possibility to offer the degree from uh, Chichester University, and then after we will move on on opening an IT center outside the UK, how everything is working. And for this, we have the specialist here, Mauro, Mauro Ciccolini. He is the COO from uh, Xenophon College London. And he's always very, very busy, but it's nice that he's on board with us today as well. And he will join us and he will give maybe as well a one minute introduction as he's the boss of everything uh, in regarding of this new concept. Mauro, tell me a little bit about you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. Thank you, Richard. Thank you very much. There is something wrong because uh, sunny day in London, rainy day in, in Rome here. There's, there is something unusual, but, but, but this is the time we're leaving. Thank you very much for being here to do the, today. Yes, I would like to, to give you a very, very, very short introduction of our brand new institution, Excel. Excel, uh, Xenophon College London, is a new higher education provider in the UK, based in UK, delivering undergraduate and postgraduate programs in the areas at the moment of business management and uh, psychology. Very, very soon we will have computer science, uh, animation and gaming, and international relations and politics, many more courses to be validated very soon by the University of Chichester, an outstanding institution among the first 30 uh, in um, the Guardian ranking, the last Guardian ranking. Uh, we, we excel, uh, we are based in central London. Uh, we have a, a beautiful mini campus uh, in, uh, in right in front of the National Museum, but our main campus is in Kent. Uh, currently, the main campus in Ashford is um, currently undergoing refurbishments and will be able to accommodate students from September 2021. So at the moment, uh, we are talking uh, about distance learning, to be clear. Um, Excel is a, uh, is a higher education provider. Um, actually, we are a spin-off of the Italian University Nicolò Cusano, uh, from which Excel takes its um, ambitious goals and internationalization profile. 
Excel's business model uh, revolves around the establishment of an independent UK institution. But uh, of course, uh, we are uh, looking for special agreement um, to provide services abroad. But Sarah will tell you uh, shortly more details about our uh, other um, possible potential accommodation we're working on in the rest of Europe. Students and staff can benefit from a traditional UK setting, of course, where courses are designed to enhance employability and promote lifelong learning in international context. In terms of flexible study, model, uh, study models, so the students can choose from pure distance learning uh, through hybrid modality. Uh, and we, we also have the um, hybrid pro uh, with two languages, up to two languages included. Um, I don't want to steal your time, so please feel free to ask uh, other questions. I'm, but I would like to, uh, to, um, to, um, uh, to talk about the, um, hi, I, the hub center uh, model. Thank you, Mauro. Thank you very much. Of Thank course, you. Mauro was uh, indicating September 2022, not September 2021. Oh, sorry. Of course, it's said September 2022 for the main the opening of the main campus. Of course. In the meantime, we are a ready enrolling students. We enroll any time in the year: September, November, January, April. At the moment, we are going distance learning. We are we are ready uh, to design these programs to be delivered at distance learning. This is not because of the pandemic. We have uh, in our portfolio uh, distance learning, hybrid and face-to-face. -face. But today we are talking about distance learning and hybrid, and we're talking about a very interesting project, according to my humble opinion, uh, to uh, establish uh, IT centers abroad to, for distance learning students. Thank you very much, Mauro. And we move on directly to Sara. So Sara, if you can give a short introduction first so that everyone understand a little bit about uh, Xenophon College London. And then after you will explain how the study will be done because there will be live teaching, live teaching, ladies and gentlemen. So all the students from around the world will be put inside an in input of live teaching, but uh, Sara, the head of teacher will explain this more. So you can share the screen, Sarah. Absolutely. Thank you, Richard. Okay. Oh. I hope everyone is seeing now the presentation. Yes. Okay, so uh, this is us, Xenophon College London, also known as XEL. And uh, what we offer at the moment is a Bachelor in Global Mis uh, Management and International Business, an MSc in Global Management and Innovation, an MSc in Digital Learning and a Digital MBA. As Mauro was telling you before, we will have a lot more uh, programs uh, by to September 2022 just to provide students with a better array of disciplines and sectors. Now, the good thing about uh, Xenophon College London is the fact that all of our programs are validated by the University of Chichester. Why is that a good thing? Because first of all, that provides you with you and your students with the certainty they are top notch in terms of quality, but most of all, because they are relevant. So we, we do not replicate what most most UK universities offer in, uh, in uh, the sector. Now, you, the University of Chichester is, uh, is, I would say, relatively old, uh, being funded in 1839. And the good thing about it is that uh, in, the, in the recent Guardian University Guide was ranked among the top 30 UK universities and top 25 for student satisfaction. This is really, really important because being a small institution, exactly like Xenophon, the, the, the emphasis is on the student and what they can achieve and the type of uh, uh, education they get out of their degree. Now, one of, one of the important things that we want to, to, uh, to focus on is the fact that our, our students will be provided with a personal tutor, which means that should they have any queries, uh, they have any doubts, any problems, they will have personalized, specialized assistance from top UK instructors. Some of our uh, core faculty members come from universities such as UCL, 
Queen's Mary, King's College, Imperial College. So the top ones from the London and the UK scenes. And most of all, we try to concentrate everything in our platform. So even though your students might study in distance learning, that doesn't mean they are left alone with pre-recorded lessons. No, we won't have any of this because they pay good, good money for an education. And it's important for us that they have uh, live lessons. Now we have timetabled around 15 to 17 hours per module per week, which means that basically all students will have around the 35 contact hours per week with all of our lectures and tutors from, from wherever they are, from the commodity of their home or as we hope from your center. We will, uh, we will be back in how the, the, the study, the IT hub works in a second. Now we have a platform that I'll show you in, in a second, uh, where the, the students will log in, do their live activities, uh, work together with uh, their peers from every country, and most of all, be able to contact any of us at any given time. Now, on top of it, we also offer experiential activities. So even if they study now, unfortunately, the COVID situation, yes, is getting better, Unfortunately, not that good in the UK at the moment. We are still around 30, 35,000 cases per day, which is a, a massive uh, problem, I would say, for normal, uh, for normal students coming, uh, coming from uh, better uh, countries in this, in this scenario. What we try to do is they can still come to do small parts of their of their program. So let's say, for example, they come and study a language because they want to add some relevant skills in the international scenario when they, they, they will then be able to find a job in their home countries, in the UK, in Europe, wherever they, they have set their eyes on. Or they want to come and learn a little bit more about a culture that is not necessarily a UK one, but they want to go around Europe in one of our centers in Madrid or Paris or Rome. This is something that can actually be part of the learning studies through the what we called the pro model. So you will find our distance pro courses will have additional two languages for free and the possibility to go and study for six to 11 months, depending on, uh, on, their, uh, uh, on their specific desire on uh, places and important places like Paris or Rome or Madrid or the UK in one of our campuses. This is the situation at the moment, considering the, the impact that COVID has. Uh, Richard, I don't know if you want to deep dive into one of these in the meantime, and then we can show the platform so we don't bore them too much. No, my point is here, we have uh, many schools here with us today, many agents who has their own school like uh, I just mentioned before, Otto, then I can see Rabbi as well from Morocco and all the people from India, etc. And uh, the most people here, they have their own school or they have their own learning center or they cooperate with some local school. The reason why they're here today, uh, Sarah, is because they want to understand how they can cooperate uh, and offer the UK degree in the home country and uh, take advantage and open an Xenophon College London IT Hub Center. How this will, will work? Um, how, how is the support uh, from Xenophon College London on this? Uh, so we will basically do everything for you. <laughs> so that's good. Uh, that, that is an, e an easy kind of model. Uh, we will provide the lessons. We will provide the, the tutors. We will provide the staff. The only thing that we would ask is that because students nowadays, not everywhere, they have the technical uh, support, the internet a reliable internet connection, or uh, something like a, a nice computer or a laptop to log in to one of our portals, we would ask you to uh, sort of make your school, your learning center, their home throughout all the learning journey. And this will be important for you because you will become a part of our learning 
but also for them because they will still find, even though they are doing in distance learning, they will still find a physical place where to stay, make connections. The more people they come from the same region, the more success or successful this operation will be in terms of their learning. This is, uh, the, the, in a nutshell, what can actually be uh, planned or achieved with XCL. And then on top of it, there will be other uh, opportunities that are external to the, uh, to the degree itself that we can discuss together in a case-by-case -case situation. So I hope that answers your questions, Richard. Uh, yes, um, I will have more questions on this, yeah. which I think uh, I'm thinking as well, uh, like an agent. Uh, so I have my learning center. So I have to follow the program that you that you are offering. That mean starting, for example, like before was the 20 September. So the next session is the 1st of November, then the 25th of January, uh, then in March, then in September again. So that's mean every single school have to follow the timing of uh, Xenophon College London, which offer the degree from CHS. This is correct? Yes, it's, it's correct. The second point is the starting time. As we know, we have time difference. We have people from different countries. When it start? When it start in the morning, for example. When it yeah, so we have we have different ranges. So because there are 30, 35 hours that needs to be accommodated throughout the week, so it will be Monday to Friday, ideally, nine a.m. UK time up to seven or uh, seven p.m. UK time. That doesn't mean in in case there is a, a different time zone that is significant. That doesn't mean that your students need to be always. Uh, logged in at an ungodly hour, like uh, two o'clock in the morning, but all our lessons will be recorded and will offer captions. So if even if your students have some issues or they're not uh, very well versed in, in English, we offer them a course to absolutely boost their confidence and their abilities in the English language, but they will also be able to follow through the captions. So all the stuff, all the notes from the lessons will be able to be downloaded. And that's a huge help. So uh, ideally, these are the, the timings. But of course, if you have, I would say, 50 students that come from a specific region, time zone is completely different, we can duplicate this program. We can discuss to duplicate this program at your own time zone. If you're discussing one or two students, then it's a different uh, situation. Then I have more questions coming in is, uh, for example, um, it will be the interaction between uh, uh, the students' life and how many hours per week will be live teaching? Absolutely, there will be interaction between students and students and students and lecturers or slash tutors or anyone from XCL. We don't want them to be left alone. They don't have to feel isolated. That's that's against what we, we, we actually offer, what we stand for. So they will have the opportunity to have timetable hours so that where they know there will be there someone will be there online live for them to talk to to discuss to uh, read together to do role plays simulations case studies or anything that you can think of and lessons as well throughout uh, we would say monday to friday 9 to, to 7 p.m but on top of it, we will also have a, a call center where students can actually access additional support in other different times, a chat system or a, an email system where we will respond up to maximum 48 hours after receiving the email. So that's... Yeah, Sarah, so how many hours per week will be live teaching? 35 hours, okay. roughly. So uh, let's presume we have a case study here, no? Yeah. We have uh, five students from Hungary, 12 from India, seven from Brazil, two from Hong Kong, and one from Russia. So interaction during this time life uh, is mean that these students can be in contact with each other all the time. Yes, absolutely. They can see each other. They will discuss with them. They will have time to use uh, Blackbirds or any kind of digital uh, means that they will want to add. They can talk with the professors. They will listen to live lessons. So let's presume uh, a class will start uh, with all these students that I mentioned before. And um, there will be a bachelor program. So yeah. before the bachelor program, are you offering as well a foundation program or an yes. English program for the students which are not good on English? 
Yeah, so what we do is, first of all, we assess the qualifications and the level of English. There are several English tests that are accepted, not only IELTS or TEFL. So uh, have a look through all, uh, all that we can offer. I'm sure that Richard can provide you with a specific list on that. But uh, the most important bit is the interview. I'll give you a case study. So we interviewed one of, uh, one of the prospective students that had a IELTS 5.5 a couple of days ago and it wouldn't be enough to start the bachelor program because we are looking at a six in terms of IELTS but we discussed with the student in question and their level of English was so high that we were not thinking of providing any additional English level so we will consider your students in a case by case scenario, regardless of what the certificate says. If we understand that the student is not up there yet, what we offer is a, an English pre-course. So that is an intensive one year or six months course, depending on their abilities and how quickly they learn. And then we reassess the situation once the level of English is uh, decent enough to start in one of our courses. After that, uh, if, if the level English is good enough to understand at least the basics, we can put the students, we can locate the students in the foundation level. Foundation level is a one-year program that is integrated within the bachelor. So you start with a foundation and you naturally progress within the bachelor program. And that has uh, a good two courses of English plus some additional uh, content that is, is linked to the, the topics that we studied in the bachelor. Or we can do the same for the master. So let's say, for example, your level of English is not good enough for entry in a master, in a UK master, but you have a bachelor qualification that is recognized by, uh, by us, then fantastic. We are going to provide you with a six months English course prior to entry in the master and then straight entry in the master as soon as you are ready. So if I understand well, if I have a, a, an IT center over here in Switzerland and I have 10 students, three can start with the English program, four can start with the bachelor and three can start with the master. Absolutely, yes. Perfect. Then, um, sorry to ask you so many different questions. Please, by the way. I receive this question from the agent all the time. So in the end of the, of, uh, the study, they will receive a degree from Chichester University. Is this correct? Absolutely, yes. They will receive a, a degree from University of Chichester. They will also have an email address uh, from University of Chichester. So they will, at all effects, be also enrolled at University of Chichester, but with the additional support of XCL staff behind. So a lot more than what they would normally get from uh, simply going to University of Chichester. So ladies and gentlemen, it's not uh, easy to, to have a, a learning center in your home country directly from Chichester University. It's quite impossible. First of all, it's a state university. Second, it costs uh, quite a half, uh, half a million per year to do this. Uh, third one, you don't have any support. But with Xenophon College London, the big win is to have the support. So if I understand correctly, when the students enroll, you provide uh, you, the Chichester University provide an email. So every student will receive like a username and a password, and then they can log in in the portal. And now maybe you can switch on the portal. You can start to show the portal yes. and uh, to continue to talk a little bit more about this. Yes, absolutely. So the, the other good thing is that not only they will receive a, a password and username from Chichester, but they will also receive a username and password from XCL. So to have additional resources and all the structure and everything, that is kind of an amazing uh, a kind of an amazing thing uh, if we if we, we if we want to say it ourselves we're really proud of that so that's good now if uh if you you can all see my screen this is what our uh course a course would look like so the this is an example so you will find here the assessment for the course all the stuff that needs to be done straight away students uh, will not have any issues if they have any problems understanding what they are supposed to be doing to get 
at the grades, they can ask their tutors. Good thing about it is that there are no final exams. So everything is coursework based and it's a lot, I would say easier that way for them to manage their time to send in all the coursework in time. Then there are the, the so-called sections. I will show you how a section look like because that the, the, then the model will replicate. So they will have the weekly schedule, which is basically their timetable that you as a center will have and we will provide to you. Then a reading list of materials, those are free for them to access. So they don't have to pay for uh, the uh, textbooks or any other research paper that is needed. Then they will have what is called a virtual classroom. So they will simply click on here, log in in the platform, click on start meeting from your center, and they will be able to be live in one of the lessons which is great it's just a click it's very easy straightforward some of the some of the actual uh, uh, courses have additional materials like this for example they're very short videos to explain the concept before they log in for the lessons and then of course again as you can see here uh, the, the lecture at what time it is which day click on uh, start meeting job done here are other links that the students can actually see in a different format, but they are all extremely free for them. And the system repeats. On top of it, we will offer them a, a digital certificate of completion at the end of the course. So on top of every, of every, uh, every having the actual uh, transcript, the academic transcript, they will also have a digital certificate of completion that they can share in uh, other social media, such as LinkedIn, uh, Facebook, whatever they are using these days. So it's, it's always good. Very interesting, very interesting, Sarah. I have one question I got from an agent yeah. here. He asked me a short quest question. Okay, the yeah. certificate issue is from uh, the Chichester University, which is fine, it's clear. But will the college, in addition, issue a second certificate? Is a question. Yeah. Okay, so we will issue a, what we call a digital certificate of, of saying we have everything. The academic transcripts will come from XCL as well. So we will provide them with a story of what their learning is, plus everything that you can actually send uh, through digital uh, platforms, as we said. Perfect. Thank you very much for answering me these questions. Let's continue. Yeah, so this is how the, the platform will look like. Uh, another good thing is, and we are very proud of this, this is what we call a media gallery. So our students will be able to start meetings from there with their peers independently from this uh, from this button, okay, should they want to contact them so they don't need to go and find additional stuff, and they will be able to record uh, stuff for their homework without having to pay for any additional software. Everything that comes from this uh, media gallery, it's included with automatic captions. Why am I stressing out the captions? I'm stressing this because Unfortunately, there are loads of people with disabilities. Some are more visible than others, others are uh, not disclosed. But it's always important, especially for international students, to be able to see and understand what is being said in English, especially from mother tongue professors. And this can be a barrier. We don't want them to feel as if they are left out. So they will always be available everything will be recorded and will always be available for them within the platform as soon as this is recorded and they can download their notes from there without having to take them to take notes and can translate these notes into their home language which is i think something uh, a lot more than what others institution can possibly say or offer sara i will interrupt you for a second yeah. Logically, yeah, well, um, there will be an assistance from the team of Xenophon College London when um, a learning center is interested to open an IT um, Xenophon College London um, learning center, let's call it like this one, in the home country, they will help you, they will explain you how 
to, to, to help the students on place. So you will be like a facilitator. The, the, the correct word is you will be a facilitator and the uh, Xenophon College London team will explain how to, to explain this to the students. So of course it will be before, uh, let's say, usually it's about two weeks before you will start. There will be some hours of explanation, but it's nothing complicated. It's very, very simple. I learned as well myself quite easy how everything is working. So it will take two, three hours to understand and uh, you will be the facilitator inside in the, in the IT center, but all the rest of the study will be done from the UK. This is the only way that um, your students will receive a degree from Chichester. But not only this, um, uh, I just got a question from an agent um, and she asked me if the students need to go to the IT center. No, no, the student can study from home as well. There is absolutely no problem. We have students study from home. We have students study in the hotel. We have students study in their own high school at the moment. Uh, so the IT, um, the IT hub, let's call it like this, or the IT hub is uh, to help uh, the agents who already have a center, you know, they maybe have a center, they maybe offer at the moment uh, the, um, the, um, the Canadian curriculum for, for high school or, or they offer the IGCSE, the UK one, etc. And maybe they want to um, include some more program. And this is all the school who are offering commercial program or secretary program, etc. And they are interested to offer a new product um, to the students. So this is um, the, the, the workshop today, but logically, every student, uh, they can study from home as well. And the, the good part is uh, from Xenophon College London, this, they integrated as well uh, the possibility for people who are uh, who has handicap uh, or they have disabilitation. And uh, this is a very good part, correct, Sarah? Yes, absolutely. We are very big in accessibility. So we try to do everything thinking uh, of how to minimize the impact on people with hidden or disclosed disabilities. Uh, and we will do as much as we can uh, from even for, even further than what we already did. So, but it's important for us uh, to, to just stress this. Thank you, Sara. Maybe you want to finalize in this part here because this is clear. Yes, I think. Uh, yes, I think that with the platform we are uh, uh, we are done. Uh, I would like just to stress that we also offer training. So uh, all our staff is trained before they join us on how to use the systems. We would do the same with the centers, and we have ded dedicated IT support uh, in any case because it's not complicated, not at all. It's a very straightforward process, but you might want to have that additional need. Should something not work properly or should a student have added queries, we are here to help. Yeah, um, maybe we can, um, you can give me the screen back to me so yeah. we can continue to talk without uh, the presentation. I have uh, one more question coming in. If the certificate is accredited, logically the certificate is accredited, is from Chichester University. Chichester University is a state university, is a top 30 ranking university in the UK. Uh, yes, I think Richard might have frozen. Uh, yes. uh, you got the snow on your Christmas. And uh, I mean, all the, t I think five, six floors, uh, uh, all the classrooms are, are around. Uh, so and it was, um, the, the location was fabulous. And of course the environment around and we, I did saw some uh, uh, students from USA who were there for a uh, uh, training. So uh, yes, of course, we're looking forward for this concept, not only within London, but as you mentioned, uh, establishing learning centers uh, around the globe. It will be a fabulous, fantastic idea. Uh, and uh, I, one more thing, let us take this forward, is that uh, if students complete first two years of degree back home, they will be able to come for the final year in in Xenophon College or Chichester University, Sarah. 
Uh, not to just the university, they will come to, uh, to XCL in one of our campuses. It, we, we just don't want to make anyone too uh, upset if uh, things change, you know, so we are trying to be very, very conservative and prudent in the way that we uh, conduct business, hence why we have taken the painful decision to, uh, to deal just distance learning for the, for the near future. As you mentioned, we have students on campus that come from Berkeley University or a University of South California, so top uh, US universities, and we have a gigantic, ginormous, beautiful campus in Kent with so many uh, wildlife that is not, I don't, I don't, if I was a student, I wouldn't be able to actually concentrate on the studying. I, I'm trying to find an office that <laughs> without a window, because otherwise I would just be looking outside all day. We have tennis courts, uh, football camps, there's plenty of activities there, lovely cottages uh, for uh, for the students to, to be in. and. Uh, single bedroom accommodations with uh, bathroom inside, which is almost unheard of. Uh, we had a visit from Chichester University a couple of weeks ago, and they were amazed by the by this fact. Uh, it's it, it's not it's not uh, something very uh, very you know uh, easy to find in the UK for especially for a bachelor student and most of all we are I would say 10 minutes away from Ashford which is an international uh, port where they can get the train hop on a train two hours ride and you are in Paris which is very cool and there's a loads of fashion districts and retailers and outlets and a, a, a huge uh, life. Not that I'm encouraging them, but, <laughs> but <laughs> if they want, they have the full international experience there. Thank you. Absolutely. Uh, 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 sorry, is, is there someone else? No, it's Richard. I, it's Richard. Oh, Richard, Richard came Richard back. back. Yeah. Oh, welcome, Richard Richard. Back. I was frozen for one minute, so, so I'm back. Yes, thank you, Pajinda, to take over this part. Um, I mean, we are here now today for the IT hub outside the UK. This is the main factor of, of, of this meeting today, which I think is very important to point out. Uh, now the discussion is about the price. Um, everyone is asking me how much it costs, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I mean, there are standard price for individual students, which are available on the website, very, very simple. But we're talking here with schools, so with schools who can provide 20, 40, 50, 100 students. And this is the good part. Uh, what we need to understand is uh, a little bit more uh, how many students you have when you want to start in order that we can make a calculation in order that Xenophon College London can make a calculation. This is very, very important because uh, we can, the, the, the official price today for a bachelor program outside the UK is 8,000 pounds. And uh, this is a, a bachelor pro, which includes as well the English program. So, and a master pro is 9,500 pounds outside from the UK. This is for individual students. And this is uh, the price, which is as well on the website. But the point here is uh, to offer to your students a much better price in your home country. So to make a calculation, uh, to give you the correct price to you, we have to know approximately how many students do you think they will be able to start, for example, in November, in January, in March, in September. So you, you have to give us like, um, um, we call this like a small business plan. You can send us a short email, you can send this to me, then after I can see this with Mauro together and with uh, his uh, big boss, and uh, we can look into this. So we have to know from your side a little bit more information in order to give you a correct price, which is good for you as well, because our aim is that you are happy and your students are happy and your students can afford to pay the fee. Because uh, if you have one student, then logically the price for one student is as indicated on the website. And as I mentioned before, for the bachelor is 8,000 and for the master is 9,500. Then logically at the moment, there are some scholarship that the student will receive as well. 
If you have individual students, more than welcome. We can accept individual students as well, and we can offer some scholarship. But the, the meeting today is more for the IT hub to understand if you are um, if you are interested to open an, um, an Xenophone College hub and to offer this program to your student. And if yes, if yes, then you have to tell us a little bit uh, uh, the idea how many students you think you can bring for uh, the English program, for the foundation program, for the bachelor and for the master. So based off that, we can make a calculation. And for this, I will just share a second my screen because uh, I wanted to, uh, and now I went out before of the system. Let me go here a second. Uh, let me check if this, uh, so this is, uh, this is, um, I prepare something for you that you can fill out. Uh, you can include uh, your name, uh, the location, the city, the country, describe a little bit uh, uh, your, your location, your IT center, your, your, your learning center, your study center, your college, maybe upload some photos if you have, just give us a little bit more information about you and tell us a little bit the number of students. You fill out this one and uh, you just, uh, uh, when you fill out this one, which I will put this on the chat system at the moment, uh, you can fill out this one. I presume you can see this on the chat system, uh, correct, uh, Sarah? I just put the link on the chat system. Can you see this? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, yeah. So yes, you, can, you can click on this link and you can uh, fill out a little bit and tell us a bit more about you. And so that we will be able to make a calculation because again, I will repeat it for, for many times, but it's important to understand if we're talking about five students, we're talking about 200 students. Before the meeting, I just received a call from one client that I'm in discussion since about three months. And he mentioned to me that maybe he has a potential to bring 200 students at Sinophon College London. So for me, it's important to understand and, and as well for Mauro to, to understand the, the number of students and the level. Because if you mention, we, I have only master student, fantastic, excellent then it's good, then we know you have the master students. For the master program students, I can add something very, very important for you to, to, to maybe to, to tell to the students. They can do the first part of the master in your IT learning center hub and the second part in London. So this is possible, no problem. They can start in November to do the first part in your, in your country, in your IT center and the second part in London. So they will receive um, the degree from teacher or they can do the full program directly in your home country. This is a possibility. A second possibility for the master as well, which can be interesting for you to know, they can do the first part in your IT hub center and the second part in one of uh, the three cities that I mentioned now, which is Rome, Paris, and uh, Rome, Paris, I'm lost, Rome, Paris, and the third one is Madrid, sorry. And uh, because, uh, you know, I get so many information, so many inputs, sometimes I get lost myself too. So you have the possibility to talk to the students because we know that in some countries, some, uh, there are some difficult to get, uh, to get a visa, but uh, maybe in other countries more easy. So if you're coming from a country which you will have difficult to get a visa for the UK, you know, you can have the option with Spain, Madrid, or with Paris, France, or with Rome, Italy. So this is the possibility with the master. For the bachelor, we, what is very good to do, they can do the first year in your, in your IT center, and then they can move, uh, if they wish, uh, the second year. They can do six months in Paris. They can do then again six months in Madrid, and then they can do again six months in the third city, Madrid and Rome. So this is uh, something new. And then even in Lisbon in 2023. So there are a lot of possibility. Now we are working as well on the options that in September 2022, they can do the second year in London or in Kent. But the, the discussion of today is that your IT center. So we have to keep with the IT center at the moment. And this is very important to keep uh, the, this discussion of, of the IT center in your home country, because uh, this will be the win-win for you financial wise, because we prepare as well a commission for you, a commission system based on the number of students. So you don't have to worry, you will get uh, the commission for your student every year. 
So this is what we want. We want that you become a business partner of Xenophon College London, and you earn the commission every year on your students. So if you have students starting for the foundation program, you know you can earn commission for the foundation, for the bachelor, three years, and for the master. So this is a big, big business for you. And um, more and more students, uh, they know that uh, to go to the UK is very expensive. Uh, we have to be realistic. Today, if you want to go to the UK, a tuition fee costs around 50,000 pounds. Some school charge 70,500, some other school charge 40,000 pounds, uh, but the price is all around 50,000 pounds, okay? Some get 1,000 scholarship, 2,000 scholarship, but on top of that, you have to calculate the accommodation, which is additional eight to 9,000 pounds. On top of that, you have to calculate the living expenses in the UK. So that's mean that uh, uh, students uh, need to have about 30,000 pounds to study in the UK, which is, is very prohibitive. Even I cannot afford to send my kids to the UK to do to, 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 to a bachelor program. It's too expensive. I cannot afford to pay this at the moment. And uh, this, uh, can you imagine uh, how situation is around the world? Now, the point is uh, to have your IT hub. You can have the students and do the degree from Chichester with a very low fee, which can be maybe, I make an example. You have 100 students starting for a bachelor program, we can work out with a fee of around 3,500 pounds for your students. Jeff, 3,500 pounds for your students to pay for a bachelor program if you bring 100 students at once in one terms. So this is a, a short calculation that I was making with another agent IT center last week. This is the point. It always depends on the number of students and the location, of course. But we are making sure, Mauro is a very, very work hard on this, that every agent, every partner will have his commission every year because we want to have satisfied clients. Mauro, is this correct? <clears throat> yes, of course, that's correct. We are very, very open-minded, very, very interested to establish this kind of uh, IT center all around the globe. It's a brand new project, you understand? And it's kind of um, uh, interesting operation. And nobody uh, does the moment in this form, in this, uh, in this, uh, in this form. So uh, of course we are, uh, we are, we want mutual satisfaction and, uh, and and good business for both of us. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mauro. What is important for you to know is when you start with the IT center, there will be one staff uh, from Xenophon College London who will fly and to visit your center as well. Let's presume uh, I make an example because I have Otto here and I, I use Otto today three, four times that he will, he has a center at the moment. I know personally that he has a center in Hungary and that he has many students. Let's presume he will start to offer the foundation, the bachelor and the master program and uh, with, I don't know, 10 students or 50 or 20 students or whatever. Then when we start, uh, we will start as well to traveling, to visit them, um, to visit the every single center. So we will make sure that everything is fine. We will eventually give as well some presentation, additional presentation on place on so when we come and as well uh, online. Uh, so there will be additional presentation. But the, the, the most interesting part of everything is that uh, the system of education is changing now. So your students, uh, let's presume in Hungary, they will be every day in contact with students from Rio de Janeiro, with India, with Taiwan, with Indonesia. So this will be a multi-culti. So globalization, the students will open their mind. They will meet friends from around the world. They will have a new vision. They will have a new future as well because everything is now change. And it, we have to give to our students a new way. And we have to explain to them the big potential they have now. And it, we, we are the people who are doing this business. If we don't explain to them, who else will explain to them? Nobody. We are the only people who can explain to the new generation that this world is changing. And we offer an education system, in this case, uh, with a degree from Chichester University, with the support of Xenophon College London, 
to be in contact with students from around the world and with live teaching. I mean, this is all on my side. And for this reason, uh, I just put here the, the link on form site. If you are interested, if you think this can be something for you, because you can increase your financial part, because before you were sending one student to the UK, one student to France, two students to Italy. But can you imagine if you can start to make business in your home country? And if you can start to bring five, 10, 20, 100 students together in your own IT hub center, how much business you will make? Much, much more than before. And if we are not taking advantage of the situation now, then we will not have a second chance because now is the right time to change. It's now the right time to start uh, to see new possibility in the educational industry. And the same is I'm doing this myself as well. Before I was in 100 even per year, I was crazy. I was traveling uh, all the time, but I realized that now I have a second opportunity to, to change as well my way to do business and to coaching school to explain uh, the different possibility how to penetrate in one country to another country, new concept, new idea, et cetera, et cetera. And I feel very much more comfortable today. And, and this is what I want to suggest you as well. Take this possibility uh, of opening your IT hub center and uh, look into the future as well, because we are becoming older as well. We are not 20 all the time. So this will help us as well, the financial wise, uh, to, 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 to bring more business to our company. I mean, uh, Sarah, if you want to finalizing everything, maybe if you want to give a final speech, it will be very kind of you. Yes, thank you, Richard. As always, a pleasure. Uh, thank you for joining us and taking time that is precious at this moment uh, to actually come and listen to what XCL has to offer. Uh, what, uh, there are loads of things that we can do together. And uh, I stress we in the sense that you are an important part as much as we do in order uh, to get our students what they deserve and what they are actually aiming for. So feel free to reach out to any of the team, starting from Richard, because he's one of us. <laughs> we, we, we want him to feel part of the family as well with all the questions that you might have uh, for, uh, you know, there, are, there will be some case studies or, or different situations. Don't don't be afraid if you've been turned down before from other uh, from other institution to just ask. We will try and see what we can do uh, in order to get uh, to the point, which is providing exceptional uh, quality education. This is what we do. This is what uh, we've been uh, trying to do for the past uh, 20 years in different countries. So we would very much like uh, to, to meet your students, to meet you. And as soon as this will be possible, please come and see us in the UK. So you will see what we were discussing before, how beautiful it might be. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Mauro, please, uh, if you want to add something to finalize everything short. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very short. Thank you very much, everybody, for attending this meeting. Yes, Richard, you got the point because internet, we have a few uh, mottos. The first is digital skills for every single student, but real digital skills because they need to be prepared with uh, serious digital skills and internationalization internationalization is not only international staff academic staff is not only language free for each of our students but also to share experience with some other international students and possibly to visit our uh, facilities abroad this is real internationalization important as because it's very important part of the education. Thank you, Mauro. Thank you very much. Thank you, Bernarda from Albania. She mentioned now that uh, she is interested to work in this project. I'm in contact with Bernarda since a long, long time, since many years, by the way. And I want to say a big hello to Albania. Uh, always nice to have you on board and to be in discussion with you. And for all the other agents, uh, as I say, I, I put the, the link, the form site link on the chat system. If you go on the chat system, you will find the link. You can fill out this link. And uh, so you can include a little bit more detail about yourself. 
Bajinder, your final word from London, of course. Oh, yes, of course. Uh, final destination, London. Final word from London. Uh, this is a really a very good concept. Uh, looking forward to the global scenario. Um, I mean, getting the UK degree in your home country. And yes, we, uh, still you got the opportunity to come to UK to, to boom up your career. Or not only that, getting a UK degree within your own home country, you will get better job options in, in future. So both options and of course, uh, uh, the uh, base being in Europe as well. So Italy is also for, uh, for, for these guys. So welcome uh, to uh, Zenoful College campus in your home country. Thank you, Jirichar. Thank you. Thank you, Bajinder. He mentioned something very, very important. Your students, if they will get a degree from Chichester University in the home country, they will find a better job because the competition is there every day is there for our students coming out from the university the competition is there when they start to look for a job so if your students will get for a job and they will show they have a degree from chichester university a top 10, 30 ranking university in the uk a state university recognized worldwide then uh, and another one who has a local university degree i presume the 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 person in charge who who have to decide then he will consider a little bit more the gentleman to, or who made or the, the, the lady who made the, the degree from Chichester University. This is fundamental. Again, if you are not an, an IT center or you're not a learning center, you are an agent, you are more than welcome to bring on board a local school, which can be a college, can be a business school, can be a university, can be a high school who just finished, who want to add some new program, can be a language center. It can even be a commercial center, even can be a job service because it happens that uh, we have a job placement company who are interested to integrate an, um, an hub in order the students can do a master program because we all know today that everyone, everyone need to have a master. But many uh, students or older students or people in 40 or 50 who did not have the possibility to do a master because on the time being they had to do a bachelor and that work, maybe now they have the options to do a master and uh, not everyone can travel around the world. So they are looking to, 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 to start to do a master on place. And this is a win-win. So this is uh, in refer of the job. Again, this presentation was recorded. So I will send uh, a copy of this uh, presentation, which is recorded to all of you later today so you will be able to go through this and maybe show this to one of your colleagues staff people work with you or to your teacher and if you if you want to start we can always reorganize another zoom meeting and in detail so for every single one or logically we will organize a zoom meeting we will re-explain everything in details so what we are looking forward is now the next step from your side is to fill out the link that i put on the chat system and so that we know a little bit more about uh, you and your interest the number of students when you want to start so that from them we can move on and arrange another zoom meeting so that will help you to to start with this uh, xenophon college it hub i think from my side is everything again all the best i will put my email as well on the on the chat system so you can see here on zoom below there is a chat system you will find the form site link to fill out and you will find my email ladies and gentlemen it was my honor as well as usual to welcome you here to my web live workshop thanks to the team of xenophon college london thank you Bajinder, for your support as usual especially the time that i went out because i was uh, frozen maybe it was because i wanted to have some little bit of coffee you know because <laughs> i need sometimes to have my you know my espresso my typical italian espresso this helped me to go through to do the presentation it was my pleasure all the best to everyone keep health see you soon thank, thank, you, thank you, you very so much. much thank, thank you. you richard yeah bye, -bye. thank you richard thank you bye bye, bye. Yeah, more